Catherine. Yeah, Mary. I know that Cascade Tech vacuum ovens are out of this world, but why am I looking at a picture of the space shuttle? Well, this is a shout out to one of our favorite customers. They sent us this picture of the space shuttle with the bay doors open while it was docking with the International Space Station. Whoa. So you see the earth here in the background, teeny little slice of the earth. And these are our friends at Langley Research Center. That's NASA, right? It is. So they used a Cascade Tech vacuum oven just like yours to high vacuum bake out this component that went into space far out. So I hear you want to use your Cascade Tech vacuum oven in degrees Fahrenheit instead of degrees Celsius. Yeah, I see that it, it comes from Cascade Tech to read in degrees Celsius and I need it to read in degrees Fahrenheit and, and I'm not really sure um, how to change that. Can you help me with that? It's easy to do. What we're going to do is push the up and down arrows at the same time. And I want you to watch this green display while I do that. So we're going to push the up and down arrows for six seconds. Nice manicure. Thank you. So the first thing you'll see is the operator menu. That's not the menu we want. We keep pressing till we get to the set menu. So um, there's a, this is a double function to push these up and down arrows. Ambidextrous, both <laughs> fingers, both buttons, right? Both fingers, both buttons, and if three, three seconds is the operator menu, six seconds is the set menu. So that's where you want to go is to settings. Then we'll use the up arrow key to scroll through this, and I would ask as a special favor to me that you ignore everything in here except the global menu. That says global? It, well. Sort of. In, in Watlow, that okay. says global. All right. Green key to advance, and it's real simple. C or F, and the up or down arrow toggles between the two. Oh, cool. If you want to program, use the controller in Kelvin, you're just out of luck. Okay. So you want to pick F, and then as always, with any of the things that we do, you can press the green advance key to back out, or you can just go ahead and press the infinity key to return to your home screen. And you'll see now that the it reads degrees F right there and that it's changed the values to Fahrenheit. Is it 74.2 degrees in here right now? Uh, apparently it is. Wow. You know why? We're smoking hot. 